We are back. More Assassin's Creed Valhalla. And what do we want to do? Just had a crazy vision quest type experience. Let's go ahead and pull up the map. Oh, actually, we do have more skill points. We got these at the last uh, episode. Stomp would be cool. These clearly lead to other things that we can't see at the moment. So let's just go ahead and get stun and heavy damage. And then we'll work towards stomp. And then we need to work our way all the way around. Ooh, the way of the bear. That's what we want. Because we have the bear aligned gear. So we'll definitely do the way of the bear. So we just need to get more skill points. But let's go ahead and pull up the map and see what is next. So we are currently in... I want to say we're in Formberg. Yeah. So we could synchronize over there. Let's go ahead and synchronize that. And then make our way back into Formberg. We're in this area anyway. It feels like it would be a mistake not to take advantage of it. Who knows when the next time we'll go up here will be. So, might as well, you know, get more of the map unlocked. Okay. This is a huge, huge animal. Looks like a moose. And it's been taken down swiftly. As we've taken down a wolf as well. No, that's not even a moo. Maybe that's an elk. Tough to say. Tough to say. I want to say that was elk, though. But let's go ahead and continue our way up to the synchronization point. Oh, destroy and loot outcroppings of obsidian to gather resources. Is that what, is that what this is? I mean, those are clearly some bows we can get. What are they talking about with the obsidian? Destroy outcroppings. Not sure. Not sure at all. But we will continue. Man, these wolves are fast. Do they want the work? Seems like they might. Later. You also want the work, white wolf? Yeah. Scurry away. Have we even take anything off this? Maybe we can only loot it if we kill it with an arrow? Not 100%. Oh, there we go. Wolf fang and leather. But that is a peak that is fairly far away. So, Ivan is asleep on his watch. That would explain some things. Okay, later. Oh! There's a fella around here. Ivan, wake up! Wake up, Ivan. Cast into the wild. This guy's on watch. He's not really doing a great job. Must stay awake. They could be anywhere. All right. Ooh, is this? Is he walking in his sleep? Something we can interact with. Looks like it would be. We use the axe as a zip line. That's beautiful. Now, the question will be, how do we get back up that? Because it's going to be no longer an option. As we look to synchronize here. Just got to be very careful to avoid the ice. So I think the way to do it is going to be going up this way. Oh, uh, look, look at the climbing display being put on by Ivor. Avor. It's close. I'm not sure we can go up on this ice. We gotta go ahead and wrap around, maybe. This looks like maybe we could climb it. And indeed we can. Let's get up to the top, and let's do a beautiful synchronize from up here. Let's get after it. That certainly is something. Synchronization complete. And where do we dive off here? Can we even? I think it'd be right down there. There's always somewhere to dive off to. But I don't see a spot at all. Yeah, that's gonna that's gonna weaken us a, a fair bit. Interesting. I don't even know what that is. Let's reopen the map. Like, what is that? 
Like, I don't know what it is. I never seem to. I don't know anything. Clearly. I mean, something's clearly... I marked it, but... I wonder what that is. And I'm still very surprised that we actually... Couldn't even jump down from there so safely. Ivan is asleep on his watch. That would explain some things. What do you mean that? We just, we just did this. Ivan, wake oh, it's up. an interact point. You will be cast into the wild. Is there something here? Do we Must watch him? Stay awake. I'm confused. What's happening? Could be anywhere. Is he walking in his sleep? Like, what, what do we do with him? If we die, everyone dies. Do we wake him up? Alright, he's... Whatever's happening to him is gonna happen. But I mean, I'm just not sure what we do here. You know? Whatever. I have no idea. Let's go ahead and mark... Family matters and get back to work. Ivan, wake up! You're headed for the edge. Oh, maybe that's what we're doing. We should save him, right? We gotta save him so he doesn't die. Is he going to ride the rope slide? No way. No way. Storm coming. Okay. <laughs> should we follow him? Yeah, I guess. Okay, here's what we're doing. Ivan, Ivan, calm down. You are asleep. No, I was flying through the air. Well, clearly. In your sleep, a harsh awakening, true, but at least you live. Have you always taken these? What a psycho! Walks? Since my posting here, when I am in bed, I worry about ways we could be attacked. When I'm on watch, I cannot stay awake. Only a fool stays awake all night worrying. You're tired when you get up, and the problem is still not solved. You speak with the wisdom of Odin, Eivor. I will think on these words when I am in bed. Consider yeah, good them call. on your watch, and sleep when you're in bed. But now, report back before you're labeled a deserter. <laughs> Go. World event completed. The Dreamwalking Warrior. Okay, so that was a good thing to do. The clan is happy to see Eivor return. Well, that's good, because I'm Eivor, so I'd like to hear that. And let's get back down there. I wonder if there's a point where we can jump off. That almost looks like it'd be a synchronization point. But perhaps not. I'm not even sure how we're going to climb down here. We'll work on it. Seems like this could be actually quite tough. If we just climb down, I think we should be able to manage it. Got to make sure to just to keep going down. Should be able to here without taking any damage at all, I would have to suspect. Yep, we're cruising. However, not cruising for a bruising. That's an important distinction. Okay, that's a little glitchy. That's a little glitchy. What is happening? What is happening? I'm locked here forever. Oh, oh, almost got out. Ah, uh, we got used it with square. We got out. All right. No. Got out of stamina. That's all right. I was almost <laughs> glitched into the map forever, which would have been worse. But we figured a way out. It's resourcefulness of a Viking warrior. Now, please go. This is like not an ideal way to go down, probably. But it seems like it's working. Might actually have to go through here, so maybe there is no need to even go down. 
I think we should continue this way. I would say a clearing is going to happen on the other side of this thing where it's another mountain. Yeah, here we go. There's the clearing. And there's where we need to be. Now, the question is, how are we going to get down here? I think just by being a beast. And yeah, we're doing exactly that. And we are back in Formberg. Talk to Robert Frost. We certainly took the way uh, less traveled. But we are back. We will go ahead and do whatever that is next. However, first, we're going to go ahead and go back to the main story. Hello. They must be finished now. The king has called for his best mead, so the talks are concluded. It should be safe to enter. Ooh, okay. I'll I'm see him now. Of course I'll see him now. I will speak with the king now. Excellent, King Stierbjorn. He's not going to be happy with me. My guess would be. I believe he will see the wisdom in it. Good. It is all I can hope for. May the... Oh, he seems un unhappy. May the winds favor your voyage, Guthormer. He seems unhappy. Eivor, come forward and explain in plain words why you have willfully disobeyed my commands. Do you mock me? I do not mock you, King. I mean to embolden you against your enemies and your own poor judgment. You know nothing of my judgment. You know nothing of my plans and strategies. Sigurd would agree with me. My son might agree with you, but he would obey me. He knows his place. Not as well as he knows his father. Imagine you are harassed by an enemy with warriors that vastly outnumber your own. What profit does open war bring? Would it not be better to work quietly through diplomacy? No. <laughs> gaining alliances? Waiting until the day our numbers outweigh our enemies and our victory is guaranteed. Do we have no allies? We're not going to call we him a coward. He's a freaking Spiegel? king, dude. Or is that your excuse to do nothing? Your confidence blinds you to so much in plain sight, Eivor. Day and night I toil to forge ties with clans to the north. Very soon you will see the fruits of my efforts. Only then will you understand. Is that all? Hmm. I'm at a loss with you, Eivor. When I took you in as my own, never did I imagine such disrespect from the child of Varian. Oh. Your father was a fine man. Just and loyal to me, he died bravely so that we might live. He died a coward, Lord. A fate I will not mirror. Why do you carry such a useless burden? Let it go. Think only of the days to come, of your future and the victories at hand. My honor has been stained. Until it's wiped clean, I want nothing else. I refuse to pick at that wound again. But if there is something that can chase these shadows from your thoughts... Oh, that's the war horn. Has come. Down at the dock. We're just this a horn in general, okay. I guess we're gonna go see what Sigurd's up to. I had a dream of you, brother. Something like that. Plus two skill points. Let's go ahead and spend those real quick, though as we travel toward the way of the bear but first the stop r3 to stop on their face okay love that and health 5.2 health like that quite a bit but i'm not going this way dual swap i don't even know how that could be useful at the moment but i'm going towards the way of the bear now what did, did they were there detractors there Minus three weight. I guess that's a good thing, though. The prodigal prince. That's Sigurd. And let's see what he's up to. Hey, hey, careful with that one. Hey, Sigurd! 
Ah, oh, look at hmm. you, blood-soaked drinker. What, have you been worried without me? Oh, and you, salt-cured Vikinger. I smell the stink of a dozen kingdoms in your beard. It's <laughs> just a start. Randvi, my dear wife. Your husband returns. Bringing gifts and riches to share. And new friends, I see. Yes. Basim. Oh, assassins! We met in Miklagant, and they show me her buried secret. Assassino! We are grateful to Sigurd for his invitation, and eager to pay tribute to your king. My brother is they sound like they're from the south. The company he keeps. You're standing safe Far south. Life. He must like you. Ah, Eivor. Save the introductions until our bellies are full. They are very clearly assassins, father. though, with those hoods. Tell him of my time away. This morning we traded with a ship passing south. They told us Eivor the Wolf Kist was captured by Kyrtvis' men. They must have cut the tail short. I killed my captors and recovered my crew. And for that your father scolded me. You know where I stand, brother. Nothing short of war will dislodge Kyrtve from our lands. But he disagrees. I know. I know. Father thinks too much and acts too little. Today that changes. I promise you. I doubt it. By the winter's end, the name Kurt with the crew will be a curse on the lips of a drunken fool. Yeah, we'll see. The king seemed like he wasn't willing to negotiate. My son, welcome home. Uh, father. Tonight we feast and celebrate your return, Sigurd. The tables are laid with barley and lamb, bread and mead. And no more, I beg you. I want nothing you would not serve a thrall. Let me be the one to honor you. I bring gifts and tales from faraway lands. After two winters away, I am full up with both. Very well, very well. Come in, Scott. That is a long time away. When fat and satisfied, Father, we will talk of Kyrtve and his clan, and how we may end their terror. Once and for all, he has dogged us too long, shamed us for too many seasons. I know this. Eivor knows this. It ends now. Yes, of course, when the time is right. <laughs> I mean, he clearly loves his real son a lot. You would. Not a big Eivor guy. We went. Shadowy tribes hurling spears at our ship. At Miklagard. We saw men bedecked in riches as vibrant as the Biverest itself. And these we took for our troubles, of course. We sailed to Rome, then Africa, past oceans of sand, warriors of all colors, and beauty the eyes must weep to behold. And now I have returned, with riches and glory to share with my family, my friends, my eyes for Strengir. So take what you desire from my horn. For this, this is only a taste of things to come. Tomorrow, the Raven Clan starts anew. Skull, Sigurd. Skull! And you, Eivor, come. I have something special for you. Oh, okay. Where are you going? What do you mean? You're, you're ditching me. I mean, you're freaking... Where are you going? Okay. I long and hard on a gift worthy of you. Oh. You've snared Thank my you. curiosity, brother. What is it? Not yet. Drinks first. Oh, okay. Can't say no to that. To my first night in Fornberg in over two winters. It must end with me soaked and wall-eyed, shouting at the shadows of trolls. And you want me to sail with you on these honey waves? Yes. You are stuck with me, Dringul. Now drink. <laughs> ah, you would put Thor to shame. Let's do, uh... I should have gone okay. easy on you. On your first day back, I should have let you win. <laughs> Gods, you should have let me start. It's good to have you back, Sigurd. Yes. 
I've missed this terribly. When I first met Basim, I regaled him with tales of our homeland. And it was then I felt a hard longing to return at once. Come. I want to know where these guys are from. Certainly don't look Nordic to me. to your gift. These excellent men were my shepherds through much of their homeland. They look the Abbasid Caliphate. About Italian or something like that. They are a clan, not joined by blood, but by a common idea. A brotherhood of shadows executing their own form of justice. In my time with them, they shared many of their most hidden secrets, for which I am grateful. And now, I gift one of these secrets to you. Ooh, a bracer. It's a it's a hidden dagger in the hand actually that attaches to the bracer. Classic assassin stuff here. Not bad. The hidden blade. Beautiful craftsmanship. What kind of smith makes a weapon like this? It is less a weapon than a tool. One we have used for centuries to fight injustice and evil. Mentor, I must protest. This is deeply unorthodox. Our wrist plate is a sacred Do tool. Don't make a fetish out of cold metal, Haifa. What matters is the mind of the one who wields it. They're gonna need Please to take a finger. Try it on. If I recall. The blade should ride on the underside of your arm to conceal it from your target. I have no wish to hide this. And I would rather not make the same mistake you two have. I like it. This is no mistake. This is a voluntary sacrifice to prove our devotion to a good start, Eivor. But you must learn how to use it effectively. Eivor is arrogant, to say the Outside. least. This is not something for all eyes. Lead on. Perhaps that is the Viking way. But the hidden blade, I'm stoked to have this. Can finally perform these like assassination kills. I would bet. This clan of yours, it has a name? Indeed. But among the tenants of our creed is a vow to never reveal too much to outsiders. In time, you may learn more, but not here, where the walls and trees may have ears. I look forward to it. Here, right, training. let me lead you through our most basic techniques. Wielded with skill and care, our blade delivers a singular killing blow. As you near your target, find your window to strike. Timing R1. is essential. Yeah. Nicely done. Nice little stab in the back. Seen a blade so sharp. Some targets are trickier than others. Keep that in mind before you strike. A decent attempt. Hmm. How do we do? Do we go in the back? Take that one down from the ledge. Should be able to climb up this. From the ledge. Oh, classic ledge assassination. A perfect strike. How about a challenge? Leap down upon that target from above. I'm missing me a sick one. Love that. Love that. Use your surroundings when possible. Strike from that haystack, for instance. Exactly, just like that. He's really going for like the back, though. Figure you'd want to go for the neck. Mentor, does Avor intend to join us? Not that I am aware. Why offer him the blade? Surely we have more. Hide them. Uh, that's it. You wield the blade well. Let us leave Avor to enjoy his gifted peace. Come. Can I crouch? Avor, let us walk to the docks and take in the night air. Nice. All right. Let's go, Sigurd. I'm down. What do you make of my new friends? They seem generous and menacing in equal measure. I know what you mean. They have learning, too. They wield numbers and writing as if it were magic. Basim has shown me so much about the world, all of which I will share with you when the time is right. Oh. 
I miss the smell of this land. Have you returned for good? Or do you mean to join this? Seems like he wants to join. Leave all that aside, Ivor. Tonight we are family again. That means yes. The here and now hmm. is what matters. Our kinship. Our clan. Our glory. I missed you, brother. Your clear head and your courage. We have not had enough of both in recent months. <laughs> you flatter me, Wolf Kissed. Keep it up. <laughs> he he's gonna die. He has a feeling of he has the feel of a character who's going to die. I don't know that for sure, but I feel it. Hopefully it's not as predictable. This fjord has grown too small to contain me, or I too large. There's so much more beyond these stony fangs that rise around us. England, Ireland, Francia, all greener pastures ripe for the plucking. Tomorrow... We make new war on Goethe, and reclaim the lands he took from us. And from there, we build a kingdom for us. I'm with you. I like it. Only say the word. Good. Get some rest, and return here at first light. Sounds good to me. As the prodigal prince quest has been completed. And that feels like a good enough spot as any to stop this episode for the time being. So thank you guys for watching. The Nordnir have spoken. You will betray us. Oh, hold on. This is wrong. That cannot be right. Having a bit of a nightmare here. Odin fought against his fate. It can be done. You oh. will betray Sigurd. I guess this could be a longer episode. Shit. Kjotvis warriors. Oh my goodness. We got a sound a horn or something? Or we chase him down. Let's upgrade the skill point first. Priorities. Way of the bear. That's the move, because we have inventory that's like that. And let's get five heavy resistance. Now, what is this over here? Critical damage. Melee damage. What is this? It's done. Health. Light resistance. Light resistance? Oh, light damage attacks. Still way of the bear. And this is perfect attack. R1 again during a weapon swing to do more damage on the next hit. Hmm, alright. So we gotta chase this guy down, though. You gotta be faster. This one would not have come alone. Bye. I should find the others. How do we find the others? Is that one? No, it's a lady. Where are we gonna find spies? Maybe in there? Come and drink! Let us amuse the gods! Well, can we hey, tell her about the spies? Alvis tells me this brew is too strong. Think you can handle a few rounds? Now is not a great time. But all right. Yeah, hey. You had me at having a drink. We got to get close to the X. Okay. Oh, we're killing it. Staggering already? There we go. I think we we gotta be killing our opponent. Oh, little tilting action. He's drunk already. That's not how alcohol works. Down it. Hurry up, Avor. Oh no. Oh no, I failed twice. Oh, this is so close. Come on. Finish it. A lot of staggering. Oh, we're drunk as hell. Oh no. 
I was too involved for me. It's it's two different buttons. But we got it. Big win. Like Odin, mead is my lifeblood. All right, well we're drunk as hell now, and we gotta find spies. So that's not ideal. Okay, we, why would I do this drunk? I don't even know where we're gonna find spies. Where would they even be? Some horses. They gotta be in the main town somewhere, right? I would think so. Oh, let's bring out the raven. Go, Sudan. Yeah, this is gonna be good. Hopefully we're able to find a spy this way. Are those spies? Sure, looks like they might be. We'll head for it. Ooh, are these spies? I don't think so. I am confused. How am I to know who's a spy and who's not? That's the king. Can we tell him there are spies? Like, what's happening here? Caught anything? Not today. The fish aren't biting. Too many passing well, this boats is... churning the water. Okay. I like the patience for pole fishing. I would have better luck with my bow. Shooting fish with a bow. That could work. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna bring the animal Meet back out. Eyes, my friend. I'm just not really sure what to do. How am I to find these spies? Is that a spy? Hold on. Sure doesn't look like a spy. I don't know. Maybe this is super obvious. But I have no idea how I'm supposed to find these. It seems like we're just seeing guys just walk around, but they live in the town. Well, that's not a spy. Locate area. What am I missing? I gotta be missing something. Oh, we can slide? I gotta be missing something. Survey the area, Sudan. Genuinely have no idea. Am I this stupid? There's like no direction to this at all. Oh. Hold on. Is this the area? Oop. That's a spy. Alright. Let's kill him. Okay, I finally have at least found one. And he will not be around for long. I will guarantee that much. But these guys are really far out. I thought they'd be just like lurking around somewhere. In the actual town? No. Not even close. I mean, it would make sense that they are as far out of the way as possible as to not arouse a lot of suspicion and draw attention. What? Oh, hello. And goodbye. 
So, tough to be a spy right around now. Oh, no. Oh, yes. <laughs> Later. Sigurd must know about this. I probably could have told him in advance, I think, but okay. Alright, so they were, uh... I thought I was looking for, like, individual spies, you know? Are you kidding me? Okay. But, uh, it turns out they were just, like, bulked up back at the, the spy camp. Playing spy kids or whatever. Alright. Hey! Let's get back to Sigurd. With each day we wait, Kjotve grows stronger. Eyes, we do not have the men to storm Kjotve's fortress. The losses would ruin us. They the were spies. We had spies here. Tell them. Until we cut off this serpent's head, it will poison us day by day, drop by drop. The poison has already polluted our waters. God save all. What happened? Spies in our camp. Three men sent by Kjotve to kill us as we slept. I returned the favor. There, you see? This is what waiting brings. We must answer this insult. They came from Nautful, that whaling village under Kyotve's control. We hid him there. Burn it down before Kyotve learns his spies are dead. He may have sent more. I can search the village while you round up the crew. No need. I will send Hytham to search the area. You can rely on him while we are away. We? Do you mean to join us? <laughs> I have not been bred for Valhalla like you, but this will be far from my first battle. I do not like this, but I will not stop you. Weak-minded king. <laughs> Just scowled at him. That's his goodbye. Do not lead my son into the same storm that follows you. Ugh. But all right. That is going to be the episode. Unless we get some skill points here at the end, but it doesn't look like we're going to. We'll be coming back and heading to pillage Kjotve supplies. So I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks so much for watching. Take it easy.